Konnichiwa, Genki desu ka? It's me, Greg from Delinquenti. Uh, I'm just sending this uh, video to Japan um, to tell you a little, little bit about the new vintage wines um, that we've just sent over from Delinquenti. Um, we're really excited uh, about the vintage um, and excited about the opportunity to share them with, uh, with everyone in Japan. So. Um, Thanks for, for viewing and thanks for having a look and um, we hope you enjoy the wines when they do arrive. Um, 2020 was a, a little bit of a, a crazy vintage, I think you could definitely say, um, both climactically uh, and also, I suppose, culturally, um, given uh, the coronavirus pandemic and, and everything that, that that has thrown at us. But before all of that happened, um, uh, we were here in Australia with a very, very hot and very dry springtime uh, in 2019, which um, put the vineyard under quite a bit of stress, particularly up in the Riverland uh, where the grapes are grown. It's a very hot, dry region anyway. Um, so when we have an overly hot and dry spring with, with heat waves in November, um, it, uh, it caused a little bit of concern initially. We also had some hail in October, uh, which damaged parts of the vineyard, which, um, which again caused a little bit further uh, consternation at the time. But after that sort of heat wave and, and everything that happened, uh, the weather cooled off a little bit and then into February and March, the weather calmed down and we had actually very mild, um, mild weather during the main ripening period for the, for the grapes which was very very good um, it meant that uh, it gave the grapes a chance to ripen really evenly very cool nights and retain natural acidity so even though overall the yields uh, the amount that we got from the vineyards was a little bit less than what we hoped for the quality of what we got was really really good and, and that comes through in the wines we don't have as much wine as we were probably hoping to make but uh, the wine that we do have is very, very good quality and, and we're really, really happy with them. So overall 2020 vintage, um, a bit of a crazy time, but uh, the quality of the, the fruit and the quality of the wines that we've got at the end of that, uh, I think looks really good.